Hey, how are we doing today? It's a beautiful day out here in Arizona and it's Memorial Day and we're maxing and relaxing, parking lot pimping, holding it down. Right now I am at a truck where this lady sells Mexican food and it's the best Mexican food in the city. I'm about to try one of her combos today and we're gonna get it cracking. So I'll see you on the other side of the video when I'm about to try the food. Holla if you can't then don't bother. Uh -huh. The ass off. We don't, we don't, we don't play none. Put you up a spray. You gotta leave a hater's brains on the dashboard. Then our young teacher today is pretty from the cradle to the grave. Then my shirt from a crash course. Rebound like a bad boy. This is the shit just to have them. Cause we're trying to put our cash to a grass pool. This ain't out of five, I don't pick a that bro. Struggle this real, but tell me what's clutch with her ribs. Love him like bag on the fist. Others that lay us the optics were looking so grim. Suffering boys from the pit. Can't commit. Attacking on never relent. Man, I'm convinced. And we are finally sitting down, getting ready to eat this beautiful meal by this lady, Emma. That's her name. She has a truck where she serves food out of. I'm not going to give the location of where I'm at because it's kind of a private location. But she has some of the most amazing food here in Phoenix, Arizona. And I'm going to, excuse me, try out a food. So, I got a platter. It's uh, Bedia rice and beans and rice and she gives you tortillas and i got two cokes now her combo is ten dollars with the combo you get a platter and a drink i myself got an extra drink because this ain't gonna help nobody at all she gives you a bunch of tortillas so that way you can kind of make mini tacos And here we go with the food. Y'all can see that. Y'all can see that. Let's get into it. Let's get into it. First, we are going to try the beans. A lot of flies out here today. Beans are okay today. Definitely need some salt. Definitely need some salt. Let's try the rice. Rice is here for something serious. Rice is the bomb.com. One thing I can say, Mexican women can make rice. I'm telling you, I've had the best rice in my life from Mexican women. Shout out to all the Mexican women that know how to cook. Because please believe in Arizona, a lot of these chicks nowadays can't even boil water. So if you get a chick that can cook, ooh, you winning big time. Moving on from that, I don't want to get myself canceled by the Mexican culture. Shout out to y'all. I'm going to try to beat you. What I didn't do is that you guys see. That's the media. You guys can see that. Mm. That's serious right there. That's serious. That's some of the best <coughs> media I've ever had. <coughs> Got a brother coughing. Please believe it, believe it, please. Man, listen. I know I didn't get a chance to show you guys the rice and stuff up close so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna make a taco do beans you can see we're gonna take some rice as you can see and then we're gonna take some of this wonderful media as you can see okay Let's fold that over like so. Mm. 
words can't express how good this shit is. Part of my language. This lady knows how to cook. This lady has quality food. She don't speak no English. Just know that she don't speak English. But if you find somebody that can interpret for you, you're gonna get a platter of a lifetime for a 1990s value, meaning in price that you're gonna pay. So, with that said, I'm gonna finish up this food and I'm gonna see you guys probably back at the house or wherever I go next. Holla, if you can't, then don't bother. Ha ha, see you on the next part of this video. We are back and I got a special guest for me today. Uh, the homie Mike, he's from California, but he's out, excuse me, out here in the valley doing some, some drifting. He's one of the leading resellers here in the valley in selling used vintage clothing. And I just wanted to give him the opportunity to promote his channel and let people know where they can find his uh, used clothing. Uh, I'll be, you can find me on Instagram, casually underscore thrifting, and uh, I'll be going back and forth on to Cali, to uh, back to Arizona. I'll be doing a uh, Rose Bowl every month, every second Sunday of the month. I'll be at Ivory's every first Friday of the month, and then uh, I, I do wings too as well. That's where you can find me at. How long have you been uh, drifting? Uh, drifting for? I've been doing it for like, I think five years already. Okay, okay. And you, you've been able to make a, a good living off doing it? Yeah. Okay. Great, great. So, with that being said, we are going to try this drink. Now, what is this drink called? Because you're part of the Mexican community, am I right or wrong? Yeah. Okay. What is this drink called? Raspado? Is it guys? See? I hope I'm not too high, I hope I'm not too low. Now, what, what is the premises of this drink? To keep you cool when it's hot. <laughs> yeah, we know that. But what does this drink consist of? Uh, I would say that I think it's just shaved ice. Shaved ice with the with the some type of juice to it, and then the way you have it here is like they added fruit to it, so it makes it different from a regular one. Okay. Well, let's cut all the beef crap and let's get into taste. Now I will say, shout out to the homie Tino. He told me to add lime to it, lime soda juice. Whatever that fly jiggy ish is. So I did so. And now we're about to taste it. <sighs> Refreshing. I will have to say, there needs to be some type of more sugar content in here to make this thing really pop off like a water ice from the East Coast. But. For it to be shaved ice, fruit juice, and fruit, it has a great quality taste to it, I would have to say. Hope you guys can see. Hope you guys can see. Ooh, this. What are your thoughts on these things? I like them. My favorite flavor is like vanilla, but I see that you got strawberry in there. Yeah. I do feel like you need to have a additional drink to keep adding to make liquid, to make, to kind of... To keep on like the flavor because it waters down. Yeah, to keep concentrating the flavor out of the fruit, if that makes any sense. Yeah, I let it, I let it melt more before I, like, or I just, I eat the ice instead of drinking the juice because then it takes all the flavor out. Okay, that makes sense, that makes sense. So, and what is this called again? Raspado. This is called, I can't say that, so I'm gonna just let him go ahead. And I don't want to disrespect the Mexican culture by, you know, butchering their words. So, if you guys are in the desert, please grab yourself a plus bottle and, and cool off. And with that said, I am going to go on with the rest of my day. Mike, uh, do you want to tell them the social medias 
and things of that nature. So if they want to check out what you're selling. Yeah, you oh. can just check me out on uh, on Instagram, casually underscore thrifting, and and then I'll have all the information on my apps where where else I saw that. Okay, and with that said, holler if you can't to don't bother. I'll see you on the next part of this video, 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 <laughs> video, video. <laughs> got it, got to eat. Gotta get to the bag. My hustle is crazy as mad. You n****s is lame and it's sad. You plain and you bland. You n****s is sweeter than yams. But I'm seasoned, I'm prepped. I'm just so attached. Hold it down like a clamp. Hold it down for my camp. Down for my... Little baby. Little baby. Little baby. Little baby. What you doing today, little baby? You don't want to be bothered? Huh? You don't want to be bothered? And we are back at the house, getting ready to take it down, getting ready to eat dinner, and chill and play with the cats. Uh, as you can see, little baby does not want to be bothered at all. <laughs> guys, listen, if you, wait a minute, before I say anything, let me show you guys what I'm making for dinner tonight. Or what I'm eating, excuse me. Uh, my neighbor, gave me some kind of like a chickpea stir fry. So we're gonna see how that tastes. That should be really, really fun. And lastly, my name is Kareem Williams. Here we do celebrity news, YouTube news, food reviews, and vlogs. If you like the content, leave a comment. Let me know how you feel. If you enjoy the content, subscribe to the channel. I love the feedback, and I'm only trying to do better. Holla, you can't, that don't bother.